Where do you stand on the abolition of ICE? I am for the restructuring of ICE under the Justice Department, which is uh, what Bernie Sanders has called for, which is what we used to have under the INS. Do we need, I'm not, I'm for some border security. What I think is that I should be uh, focused on drug trafficking uh, and terrorism, uh, not on criminalizing mothers with kids. And that's what we had uh, back under the Justice Department and the INS. I see no reason we can't uh, do that. Well, it's not like before ICE was around, we had total open borders with no security either. I mean, it's- No, like we, we had the INS under the Justice Department, and that's where I think that's, that's what ICE agents have called for, and that's what we uh, ought to do is restructure it so that you have a very uh, clear sense. You've got uh, those people who are dealing with uh, uh, people crossing the border as civilians uh, in one agency under the Justice Department, and then you have a separate agency under national security threats and homeland security of terrorism and drug trafficking. Right now, the president's actually making us less safe because he's devoted all these resources on chasing mothers with kids uh, to try to uh, uh, prevent people from coming here. Uh, last I checked, I don't think any American thinks that a mother with a toddler is a national security threat to the US. Right. All our resources are going there instead of actually going after human trafficking, drug trafficking, terrorism. So the restructuring, and I think Democrats have to be smart about this. Like we've got to say, we actually would keep the country safer uh, and not abuse people's rights and be more humane about it and true to our constitutional values. Mm -hmm. And ICE as an organization hasn't done that. That's why I feel like in this sense, our country is a lot like espresso, better without ICE. Get your news on with Rhonda. Do you want to know what's going on? Together and make it our own. Get your news on with Ron. If you wanna know what's going on, getting our news on today.